Hello and welcome. Hope you're all doing well. So, bit of a bike video. Um, as you all know, I converted my gravel bike and the drop bars to the retro style looking handlebars, slight, slightly riser for the easier ride to work. It has been phenomenal to ride, absolutely amazing. And I can't fault it one piece. It is just such a more comfier ride. Yes, it looks a bit granddaddy. Yes, it's not to everyone's taste, but who doesn't like a bit of retro? So, going along the lines of retro, also I fitted these shiny new DMR wing back handlebars and a DMR Defy stem, which are phenomenal. Absolutely love these. So, long story short, I'm going even more retro. Let me show you. So, my father-in-law, he had, a, he had a new shed recently, he found some old, some old, some of his old bicycle bits and bobs and he found these. And I'm just like, oh, hello. He was going to throw these away. So these are quite narrow, <laughs> quite narrow, bloody hell, look at that. Very narrow aluminium ATB bars. I think it's going to be uh, more like OTB at this rate, isn't it? Over the bars. But anyway, I quite like them. Very retro to go with my retro look. Now, grab a bike, come mountain bike. So uh, let's get cracking with these, shall we? Oh, also forgot to say. Think of it as a resto mod, I suppose you could say. <laughs> Cheese. So these are going to be going on as well. So I'm riding to work up a hill. There's a bit of a hill I have to use. I have to go up. I'm normally puffing out my ass by the time we get to the top of the hill. These will be going on the end, so I like to ride like that sometimes. It'll be quite nice, I think. It'll look a bit shit, but it gives it the retro look, doesn't it? <laughs> I hope they fit. <laughs> I'm sure they will, but we'll soon find out, won't we? Oh, and look at that stem, look at that. A Pro Max stem. So we've got a Pro Max stem to go on. We've got, I don't know what the bar ends these are. Looks like a Kaolin again. So we've got Kaolin bars with a Kaolin a, a Kaolin uh, bar ends. Oh, yeah, it says on the cat then, look. We've got Kaolin handlebars. I'm pretty, I'm pretty chuffed this. This is going to look proper retro now and uh, make it a little bit more twitchy. Like I said, I don't really do nothing with it fancy on the way to and for it. I might do the odd curb jump. Like, Who doesn't like the odd curb jump? Anyway, let's make this more retro, shall we? Let's get cracking. Let's get these fitted. And I'll let you know where I'll get on. Let's video it. So first things first, let's loosen up all the little levers. One. Oh, God. So. If you wanted why I'm a bit sweaty, but if you do see what's in my face later on in the video, it is hotter than Satan's nappies and a freaking budgie smugglers at the moment here in the UK. It is bloody hot. I'm not gonna lie, why am I sweaty? Let's whip this light off. So this light, by the way, is a Les 9 1300 XXL Marco drive. I'll tell you what, you can burn your freaking retinas off of this. Yeah, look at it! This is amazing, I love this light. The only, the only thing I would say I don't like about it, it doesn't have different modes, it's got two modes. Burn your retinas, and the other one's just blind you. It's the only thing I don't like about this light. Only thing. So I'm going to try and be cocky here. It might work, it might not work. Can you see what I'm doing? I'm going to try and slide those off. 
minus one zone. Look at that. Da da da. Balls off. So here we go. That's fit the yellow balls. Fingers crossed that fits on there. Oh, look at that appetite. So I am going to take some stems out, which put some spaces out, which I'm fine with. Let's see if that, that that's like. Let's take out one more. Look at that. That is probably about right. Oh my god, how narrow are those bars? Well, we. This is proper <laughs> oh, for what? We are now going to need a cat. Let's see if we've got any cats that are matched. Oh, there's a brown one now. A little bit of black. Plain black. What would you, what do you reckon? A bit of plain black. A bit of red. Fancy red. Another plain black, I think. I've got a bit of brown there, a bit of brown now. Well, that says, oh, what's that say on there? I don't know what that says. I think, look at that. That's right, there's no silver on 40, otherwise I'll do a silver. Have some of that. Let it do for now. Da da da. Oh gosh, you fell over in, didn't you? Look at that. Doesn't that look funky? So I tried fitting that beforehand, but unfortunately, it's a bit floppy that even Viagra won't work on that. So uh, I did try packing it out with a load of inner tube bits, cut up an old inner tube. But again, didn't work. So I'll see if I can get some kind of spaces for that. Because it's quite a gap. I'm sure I can find something. And I might fit that eventually anyway. But anyway, for now, let's put the old ding ding on. Ding ding! One side on. Shift the old bell up a bit further. Wow, it's going to pop on that one. So, here we go. That's what we've got so far. That's a uh, very narrow. But there we go. We're nearly done for that. We jump with that. That's a. Uh, <laughs> it's gonna be a fun first couple of lives, I think. Oops. Not going the wrong way. Not familiar with it as such. Pop that off a minute. Pop that off. There you go. Sort of. And quick. It's in. A bit of OCD in there. That's all. Just a bit of OCD. Might have to cut those, it's a shame. But I've got plenty more cables. Got cable ties. <laughs> so 
great thing is, we don't want to do these all the way up, so should you fall off, you don't get damaged too much. That's the thing we do. You can shift if you fall. Same with the brake uh, gear levers. Just enough. That will probably be enough. Probably a bit more than that. That down. Pop up the bit so it's not so flat. Slack in the bearings and didn't realise that. And we are done now, hopefully. Happy days, let's get the printer up again. There's a little bit of a slack in the bearings and didn't realise that. And we are done now, hopefully. After done the build, and uh, <laughs> yeah, well, I've got to say, it's, it's quite entertaining. <laughs> it's very twitchy, well, I wouldn't say very twitchy, but it's a bit more twitchy than what I'd hoped it would have been. But you know what? I, I don't care, I think it looked kind, kind of cool like this. A little, little bit of a retro look, and uh, yeah, quite happy with that. More of a retro look, anyway, I suppose, and uh. Yeah. So what? So what do you guys reckon? Make make a comment in the comments below. Comments below. Comments box below. Below this video. Yeah, I'm quite happy with it actually. I might need to tidy up the cables a bit. So I'm not uh, very happy with those. I'm sorry about all the clutter that's on there, but I like to have my older. Because it's a bit wet. Because it's a bit overcast and wet. Not overcast. Mm, a bit sunny and wet, then obviously the old light and the older. And the bells decided to. Oh, I'll cut that bit out. <laughs> so, here we go. The retro gravel bike builds to flat bar has gone even more retro. What do you reckon? I quite like it anyway. So there we go, little chat. See all the background behind me as well, can't you? Um, so, yeah, bike's all done now. Quite happy with it, very narrow, not gonna lie, but the bar ends are a godsend on going up, going up the hill, and even going down the hill, I suppose. There we go, bike build is done. Just sit in the corner. Narrow bars, very more retro. Quite like how it's come out. At first I was very, a bit like, oh gold, what's it going to look like? But it might make good content, but it's not a bad ride. As I said, a bit twitchy, but I like it. I'm going to shut up jabbering now. Remember, if you're liking these videos, give us a like, share, and, and a nice big fat subscribe. It all helps the algorithm to help this channel grow. Remember, we want to grow so we can give away the money we earn. Yes, give it away. So should our YouTube channel there, YouTube channel ever become mon mon monetized and true enough, we can make a living of it and give money away. That's exactly what we're going to be doing. Giving money away or items away, holidays away. As long as we can make enough to make a living out of it as well. Anyway, catch you all real soon. Like, share and subscribe. Goodbye. We'll